in front of you. The Knicks are not a very good shooting team. Want to put the ball. Tobias Harris, it would be good to see him play. Then he can knock them down consistently. Tobias Harris. Well, Tobias about six assists or so just to get himself going. Well, he's got it going on early, Olive. He has come out, hit his first three. He has got lazy on their way to their sixth worst season in their history as Tobias had a better chance. Shake Milton teeing up a three, and the Sixers come out on the floor. Tobias Harris. Randall lost it. Thibel has Harkless. Got it done. Well done by Matisse Thibel. There's a drive and a fine finish by the rookie Thibel. Nicely done. Al Horford pulls his way to the hoop and taking him to the weight room and taking everybody to school. 14. Korkmaz buries the three. Well done by Furka. Philadelphia-based sports agent has become the next president of basketball. Got high standards and his one success yesterday. It's not good enough. Kyle O'Quinn. Scott, the beneficiary, but well done. Nice. For a nice give up indeed. And Robinson slamming for his career. Harris teeing up a three, just picking up where he left off. Milton hits for three. Got it. That was really well done by Milton. Rather healthy three, and he drains it. So let me say this. Opportunities to contribute. Boy, Shake Milton. Richardson, who has struggled and a badly needed hoop. And there, slamming for two, compliments of Tobias. Hustle, hard work, his length. Richardson, Richardson. Tobias Harris all the way to the cup, beating Mitchell Robinson off the side of his body and shooting left shoulder shot. Josh Richardson all three did not count as we go to the fourth quarter. And that two will count. Horford for a three, got it. Milton had the bigger Bobby Portis on him. Horford stays away and bombs away. Oh, he's won me over. I mean, I wasn't a doubter. I have a hard time doubting people, but... Harris, it's for a three. Yes! Killer Hurry, Harris giving it up. A three from Milton, yes! Hit the deck as well, but Shake Milton has been brilliant tonight. Wire-to-wire -wire victory. Again, they tie their season high with their fourth consecutive win at home. Tobias Harris leading the way from the get-go, finishing with 34, seven boards, and seven assists. Again, the Sixers 28-2 and two at home, the best record in the NBA. They well, that is a little bit more like it as we welcome you inside our studios. This is Sixers Post Game Live brought to you by Cure Auto Insurance. Amy Fiddle, Jim Lineman, Mark Jackson, and gentlemen, we knew that Tobias Harris and Al Horford and Josh Richardson had to step up. Tobias said it last night. You heard from him right there with Serena Winters. They felt that they needed to come through for this team. You look what Al, Her Al Horford and Tobias Harris did. They combined for 49 points, 14 rebounds, and 16 assists. Mark Harris was on fire tonight. Can we expect that? Maybe not the numbers, but the shooting. He shot the ball a lot more. 21 field goal attempts. I'm okay with that. I'm loving that. Why? Because it's constant aggression, constant imposing your will, not sitting back allowing the game to come to you, but trying to take over the game. Whether he makes some shots, which he's going to do, and he's going to miss some shots. But I think it's important that – with uh, Joel, we don't know how long he'll be out, and Ben being out. We need someone to go step up and take on that role of being an aggressor. Has to be Tobias. We saw this Harris win the first game that Ben Simmons missed, Coach, and he had 18 field goal attempts and a good one, good game. Uh, that was two nights ago. This one, 34 points on 21 shots. Do you like that number, that aggressiveness from him? Yeah, I mean, uh, th this, uh, I don't mean to say this in a flip way. Uh, just look at the numbers. When Ben is not there, and Joel, your high score. Who's the next best scorer? It's Tobias. Mm -hmm. So why not give him the most shots? Or why shouldn't he go out and try to be real aggressive? He's the one with the most potential of the remaining roster. Not that there aren't other guys who can score. He's the best opportunity to score. So, yes, for him to go out and lead the pack like this, that's what the Sixers need from him. Yeah, I just want to say another outstanding game. You mentioned Ben's absence. Shake Milton. Yes. 
He's showing me more and more. Mark Jackson's been a fan since the beginning of the year, and I'm seeing a lot of what Mark liked way back when. This guy has had to run a team. He's very, very stable out there, and he knocks down open threes. Yeah, Shake Milton with another brilliant performance, and he's uh, showing that he's worthy of filling in this point guard role and getting these starts in place of Ben Simmons. If you start adding up the, uh, the statistics of Al Horford and Tobias, you know, the, the, those two were, uh, were, were excellent tonight, and, and we needed it all. And after a disappointing team performance, that I know they would wish they had that game back for them and us to come out and respond as those two did uh, was a great sign, and it doesn't surprise me. Uh, yeah, just uh, taking the opportunities that were presented uh, in the beginning of the game, had uh, some good looks going, had some good... Um, we had a good pop to our flow, uh, to our offense, and was able to get some just in the flow place. And uh, once I'm able to get in the flow and the ball is able to move around, you know, that's where I'm at my best. And um, you know, just carried that throughout the game.